so happy. My postgraduate work permit got approved. I didn't want to risk it. You're probably wondering what I was doing the past three months. Don't be like me. I didn't really have a plan B, so if it didn't work out here, I don't know. Thank you, Canada! If you're new to my channel, welcome. My name is Eliza. You can call me Eli for short. I'm an international student here in Canada or was an international student. It's so gloomy today in Edmonton, but I don't care because today I'm so happy. My postgraduate work permit got approved, so yay! Now, I know I should have done a vlog regarding how I applied for a study permit, but I wasn't vlogging yet in 2017. I'll do another vlog for that for next time. But for now, let's celebrate this! In my case, my permit took really long to process. It took 3 months or 115 days as suggested in the CIC website. Technically, I don't have the work permit yet because I don't have the physical copy. They're gonna mail it to me. But... I got the email from them saying that I have um, a status update on my CIC account and that's where I checked and that's where I got the news that I got approved. So my work permit is valid for 2.4 years because that is also the validity of my passport. And right before I came here to Canada, I renewed my passport. but. It was that time where they were renewing for just for five years. I didn't make the cut for 10 years. Maybe um, on the physical copy itself, it will say that I could extend it. I'm not sure, but we will see once it's here. So now I'm going to stop showing my face and show you my screen so that you can see what I got from the CIC account. I'm already signed in and the first thing that you will see would be your application and its status. So there it says I'm currently approved and let's check on the full application status. Once you've clicked and you're already on this page, scroll down and you will find their final decision right here. So it says approved and you will also find the expiry date of your document. Mine would be on March 20, 2022. And also, you can find your approval letter right over here. So let's click this. This is what the letter looks like. Um, it has the date from yesterday. So probably they approved yesterday and they just emailed today. The letter has my name on it, of course, my address. And on the body, it says your application to remain in Canada as a temporary resident has been approved. It has the type of permit that I have and apparently it's an extension even if it's a postgraduate work permit given only once in her lifetime and it's written again over here the validity and the document number. It also says here that this letter is not valid for travel and is not a permit allowing you to remain in Canada. So it means I still have to apply for a visa. Once I receive my permit from the mail, that's probably when I will apply for the visa. There you go. Can I just say it was really really hard to wait for 3 months because I cannot do anything. It says on the CIC webpage that I could work while waiting for a status. But I didn't want to risk it because I wasn't working at that time when my student permit expired. So there was no work to continue on. So I wasn't also sure if I could apply already for a job because I think they're gonna reject me anyway if I did because I didn't have anything to show them. I don't have any permit or like any evidence that I'm legal to work here in Canada. You're probably wondering what I was doing the past three months. Well, basically nothing. So in the first month, I was in the US. Um, my family was there for vacation. They weren't able to get a temporary visa here in Canada, so they weren't able to attend my graduation, unfortunately. So we just met in the US instead. And for the second and third month, um, Probably YouTube because I was editing a lot of videos that I wasn't able to edit when I was 
still studying. There were a lot of pending videos for me to edit. Even if they're late videos, I hope you still watch them. Thank you. I take a lot of time editing my videos because as you can see, I'm not really good at speaking. So, bawe bawe lang. I don't know the English version of bawe bawe lang. But I'm trying to make up for my speaking through my editing. So, I hope you're enjoying my edits. Um, I really do enjoy making them as well. Mm, what else? I went out a lot with my friends. I went to Calgary. Mostly, I've been spending money. So, don't be like me. Also, in the past three months, I went crazy thinking, what if I don't get approved? But I still did. I didn't really have a plan B, so if it didn't work out here, I don't know where I would be right now. So thank you, Canada, for approving me. I'll be in the Philippines because that's where I live. But it's been a while since I lived in the Philippines. Before coming here, I was working in the UAE, but that's for another story. So that is the end of my video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please like this video if you enjoyed it. Please subscribe to my channel if you want to see more. And please comment down below if you've got something to say.